everybody in YouTube land. It's good to see you again. We're here today to do another drawing for our patrons for the um, Sugar Creek Forge uh, 2014 Friction Folder Build Along. And I'm here with my good buddy, Brad Miller. Hello. Whom uh, I affectionately call Boo Radley. And uh, Brad's gonna gonna help us draw today, but uh, we'll be we will be drawing for a couple prizes. But I wanted to talk about what you see before you. These are all knives that are going to be going into an auction for us. We're going to be doing that pretty soon. Stay tuned for information. But all of these knives will be auctioned, and the proceeds from those knives will go to help the guys at Bomba Forge and uh, the mission that we're accomplishing. So anyway, um, Brad was looking over them, and he's got one he really likes, and he's going to tell you a little bit about it now. All these knives are great, but as I was looking through here, I saw this one from Jason Browse from uh, Browse Blades. Let me open it up for you. Not sure what this model is called, but it's just uh, it's a beautiful knife. I just love how uh, clean and I mean it's it's a beautiful knife. It's a so slick action. It is. I mean I'm gonna be bidding it up pretty highly, but uh, if if you want to, you can try to bid as well and. Uh, I would definitely, <laughs> definitely um, recommend this one. So. All right, great. So we've got a lot of interesting um, stuff here, and we'll be talking more about this later. We have this beautiful knife here. This is a uh, custom folding knife, a uh, slip joint folder, two blades. This is made by Rick Hinderer, and it's got uh, mammoth ivory scales and a mokume um, bolster that he made. And uh, you, you might have seen this in one of my earlier videos, but I really decided that this knife needs to go into the auction for the cause, so I'm donating this. So beautiful, you like Rick Hinderer? This is one of his art knives from his uh, early work as an art knife maker. He forged the Damascus uh, himself, it's beautiful. And uh, so we've got that and a whole bunch of other knives, Three River Blades. Uh, Mr. Kaiser, thank you so much. A beautiful one of his knives is going into the auction and a whole lot more. One special knife, too, because it went with us to Africa, is this beautiful knife by my good buddy and partner in this whole deal, Mr. George Icard. And this is just a gorgeous, gorgeous knife that he made specifically for this auction and donated. And actually, we took it to Africa to show the guys at Bomba Forge and brought it back. We'll show some more pictures of those things later. Um, and keep you posted on when and how and where the auction is going to happen. One of our clients is donating some space on their online auction site, and we're really tickled about that. But um, I think right now, without further ado, let's do it. Unless you got something to add. I, I'm just going to say, this. you made this one, right? Oh, yeah, right? yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. This is the knife, um, obviously, from the build-along itself is what you guys are making. And so, I mean, this is this looks way better than any, any other knife. Um of this model I've seen, so I'd go for that one as well. I just want to put that in there. It's a beautiful Tim Troyer knife. <laughs> All right, so let's let's get to the drawing. Um, today we're going to be uh, drawing for two two cool prizes. This is uh, an Ontario rat that was donated to us by my good friend Mr. Bruce Rugg, Nebulax One Two Three, and uh, beautiful knife, great sheath. It's sharp. Uh, I've never had a knife from Bruce that that he didn't sharpen and get wickedly keen. And then, all the way from Africa, we Ooh. have a solid ebony. That's um, beautiful. Maasai style war club. I found out the African name and probably forgot it. But anyway, <laughs> this is beautiful, solid ebony. Um, it, it's just awesome. I mean, you hold this in your hand and, and, and you just know you got some serious stuff here. Plus just the value of the exotic wood that it's made by. So, or you it's made beat with, almost anything. With well, almost anything. And uh, so anyway, um, here we go, our famous uh, cheesy, licious uh, kind of Christmas crock. We're going to stir around the names which are in here from all of our patrons. And I'll hold those up, and Brad, you reach inside. And we're drawing first for the Ontario Rat. Out comes the name. Oh, the we got George Icard. Ah! <laughs> Is it really? Yeah. <laughs> George Icard, you are a winner. Thank you for your patronage. And uh, here you go. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, All right, so we're stirring, stirring, stirring the patrons' names. And now we're drawing for this beautiful ebony uh, club thing and uh, ready for our name to be drawn. I'm ready. Got a couple there. All right, we got... Chris Walton, 
Awesome. Chris Walton, Chris you are Walton. the winner. And uh, we just hope you really enjoy this. Again, uh, I carried this back. Uh, uh, either I did or George Icard did in our suitcases all the way from Africa. And we'll be getting these out in the mail. Um, thank you again for your patronage, everybody. We've, we've just had such a good time. Thank you so much for the support that you've been given to this project. I'm excited. I just got some photos yesterday from some knives that the guys are making in Uganda. They are so excited about um, our support and helping them to make a living and make a life. So thank you very much. Have a great week.